Today we are going to see Lalita Sasranamam Shloka 60 recitation and word by word meaning. Chara Chara Jagannatha Chakra Raja Niketana Parvati Patma Nayana Patma Raga Samaprabha Chara Chara Jagannatha Chakra Raja Niketana Parvati Patmanayana Patmaraga Samaprabha Chara Chara Jagannatha Chakra Raja Niketana Parvati Patmanayana Patmaraga Samaprabha Now let's see the word by word meaning Chara Chara Jagannada. We take these two words together. So, Chara Chara Jagannada. Chara Chara means all the beings that has been created, both sentient and insentient. That means those are living as well as non-living. And Jagannada. Nada means the leader. Jagat means the world. So, Jagannatha means one who is ruling the world. Charachara Jagannatha means Devi is also the equivalent power like the Bhagavan Vishnu to rule all over the um, world's um, creations that is both living and non-living. So, Devi is the power who is also the Lord of all moving and immobile things. That means some creations can move from one place to another like the human beings, animals, birds, etc. But immobile things means uh, the trees, plants, that those are all the cre uh, all are also the creations but it cannot move from one place to another like us. So for everything, one should be able to take the control of their uh, protection. So, Devi is the power who takes care uh, of all the creations just like the Lord Vishnu. That's why Devi is called Chara Chara Jagannatha. Chakra Raja Niketana. This one also, we take the two words together. So, Chakra Raja Niketana means, Chakra means the um, wheel. Raja means the king. So, Chakra Raja means Devi is considered to be the ruler or the leader of the all the uh, wheels of life. And Niketana. Niketana means she is the target or she is the above because she is uh, on the heart of Lord Vishnu. So they both together maintains and preserves all the creations. So uh, Devi is considered to be the um, middle of Shri Chakra. Shri means prosperity. And when you consider all the wheels of life, the Devi is considered to be the center who is controlling the wheel. That's why Devi is called Chakra Raja Niketana. Parvati. Parvati is one of the form of the Devi who is considered to be the daughter of Himalayas. Parvati. So, Devi is um, the wife of Shiva and they both take care of the, the destruction of the creations at the end of all yugas. When there is a dissolution that happens before a new yuga starts, there should be a destruction to all the creations that uh, the uh, Bhagavan has created. So Parvati Devi along with Shiva they both together take care of it. That's why Devi is called Parvati. Patma Nayana. Patma means the lotus. 
lotus petal and nayana means eyes so devi has eyes which is very pretty like a lotus petal which is very gentle and devi's eyes is so much of gloriness that it will attract all the devotees to follow what the devi is instructing and devi will bless them to uh, with their eyes with all prosperity peace and happiness so devi's eyes are that much powerful with the eyes she controls everything that's why devi is called patma nayana patma raga sama prabha so we take all the words together so patma raga sama prabha that means patma means lotus raga means the um, way the lotus is treated that means the lotus is considered to be um, very much delicate and gentle sama prabha prabha means shines sama means just like so patma raga has another meaning of a precious stone like ruby so devi shines just like a ruby and devi has also um which is very beautiful and which gives a divine power and which shows out the light and path to all devotees just like a patma raga jewel so devi's um all the uh, form is like a way she is leading us to the path of dharma so she shines like a patma raga jewel that's why devi is called patma raga sama prabha chara chara jagannatha chakraraj niketana parvati patmanayana patmarag samaprabha chara chara jagannatha chakraraja niketana parvati patmanayana patmarag samaprabha chara chara jagannatha chakraraj niketana parvati patmanayana patmarag samaprabha Thank you.